I know thanks for joining us on this very special edition <coughs> of the Executive Media Chat featuring the Honorable Minister of the Federal Capital Territory, His Excellency, Jason uh, S.O. Wiki. Of course, it's the second in the series uh, since the Minister, along with others, uh, took the oath of office sometime in uh, August this year. So we are here this morning to keep tabs on what has happened since the last edition of the series. My name is Benga Arulima. I work with AIT and of course my colleagues from the uh, three other uh, yeah. television networks that are involved in this telecast are here. Yes, I'm Chamberlain Nusso of Channels Television. I'm Fisayo Ogunfui, Nigerian Television Authority. I'm Ayodili Uzubaku, TVC News. And of course, guys, our guest is there. Is, isn't that uh, isn't that funny? He's our guest, but he's hosting us in his office. <laughs> Good to see you, Honorable Minister. Thank you very much, Benga. A lot has happened since the last time you faced this uh, area of uh, cameras. Uh, we've seen the establishment of the Women Affairs uh, Development Secretariat, and of course, the swearing in of the Mandate Secretary. Uh, we've seen so many other things you practically been on the move every day uh, let's start with these issues one after the other perhaps we should start with the one that is generating the most controversy right now and that has to do with the insistence of the mct administration that c of o's if you want c of o's or you want to is it renew or so you have to pay five million naira, and that is generating a lot of controversy how did you come about this sum of five million naira in the first place? Well, uh, Boyga, uh, thank you very much. And that is why sometimes it's very important to have this chat in order to educate the public. The FCT administration never insisted that there will be a charge of five million naira per year for. What happened was that before I came on board, there were these contracts awarded by the Federal Executive Council for certain people to, on behalf of the FCT, to collect CO4 for mass housing. And when I came on board, I said, I don't understand how this kind of contracts could be awarded. We have a lot of issues pertaining to the developers of those mass houses. And so many people who bought houses have been clamoring for security of their property and for commercial purposes they need to have the CO4 of the property they bought. And it means that the developer have only one CO4 for, say, in an estate that has over uh, 500 houses. <laughs> and how could that be? So I said, look, the FCT on this road can collect on this video, I can collect myself. Again, there are people who had land or who allocated land in the area councils. And you know that by the FCT Act, all land belongs to the FCT. No area council has power to allocate land to you and issue you any CFO. And in order to remedy some of these anomalies, we set up a task force to say, listen, we don't want to go back to cause some problems for those that were located land and give you certificate by the area councils. And so what we will do, we will say, okay, let's forget about the allocation, but we can now properly document it by issuing you COVs. And then for the mass houses. And so the task force came up that, look, because of 
what we are trying to introduce now, which we have gotten the verbal approval of Mr. President, we are just merely waiting for the official. That there have been a lot of discrepancies, a lot of cloning of CFOs. And so we have come up with an idea that every allottee who seeks for CFO, who applies for CFO, that must supply his NIN number, that's national identity uh, number. So that, take for example, Boenga has a CFO, you will see his NIN number. That will also help in terms of security checks. And so all we need in this property, after all, so many people can answer the same name. So, uh, uh, somebody can answer, you, you can't say you're the only one who, so, somebody can answer Frank Amadi, for example. A lot of can answer Frank Amadi, for example. So in the system, you can't say Frank Amadi, which of the Frank Amadi? But with the new number, two, two persons can have one new number. So everybody has a new number. And so this is one of the features we are going to put in the new CFO. Two, if the corporate body, corporate bodies don't go with the new number. So each corporate body, if you have a property, you must put a DVN. Right? Now, even in this case, of introducing this uh, NIN in, this, uh, in the CFO, so many people have not even registered. So that also makes them to go and uh, register. Now, but these are features that will be incorporated in the CFO. For the future? These are features, features. No, is it for those who want to collect in the future, or will you also no, affect those who already it. have? No, even those who have, we are going to do a recertification oh. so that everybody that has had CFO would come back for recertification so that we we'll incorporate this name number. And they have to pay your money. I'm coming. I'm just coming so that you don't need to rush. <laughs> those who have CFO before don't need to pay this money. Why else you can pay maybe 50,000 okay. naira? Okay. Corporate body, maybe 100,000 naira. Because you already have CO4. All you are doing is to recertify in order to incorporate these new fixtures. And then you will see so many things will come up. It helps in terms of security. It helps to improve our revenue uh, generation. There are so many people who own about seven properties. You know that. Now, it will not identify them. I know they are supposed to pay taxes. For security, they all over the world. They identify, oh, this house, they go to the system and look at the system and find out that it's Benga. What is the problem here? Benga has to be accountable. All right? So, you, you, you are not looking at it at the level of bed. So, what I did. For those who have not had CFO, where you have this mass uh, house. So when they came out, I said, look, we have to have a whole interactive section. I think for the first time, I can sit in my office and take a decision. Yes, you will claim, oh, it's too high. I agree with you. But again, you still need this, uh, the CFO. But I said, no, let's go and have interactive uh, section with all the stakeholders, developers, and those who have bought from the developers. So everybody was there. We allowed about six people to speak. It was very interesting. I'm sure when he came in this morning, he would have watched the documentary. So the, 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 the tax force proposed five million. And the stakeholders said, no, let it be reduced. Are you going to do it on those whose property is four bedroom, five bedroom, one bedroom, as the case may, may be? But you again, you understand that CO4 is not given based on whether 
It is to uh, to be do more three bedroom. It's the land. Yes. <laughs> All right? It's the land. The only difference is that when you have like say three thousand square meters of land and I have one thousand square meters of land. In your annual rent per grand rent, you can't pay the same. Right? Okay. But in each one of CO4 is the same. I don't know where, whether your collection of CO4 is uh, the same. But annual grand rent mm -hmm. are not. Would you don't pay the same. Size yeah, for, size I for thought you said that you consider if you change whether or not everybody should pay the same amount no, of CO4. I said we were not considering that stakeholders meeting. Yeah. Okay. For the mass housing, not for those who have already had CO4. Right? So at the end of the day, I told them, no, we need to reduce it. And it was reduced okay. to so about so 3.5 or what. Okay. So this... Across board? Yes. So this <laughs> rumor of five is not million. correct. And that's why people should act with it. And the people were happy that this was the first time in their history to sit down with the minister to discuss, to interact, to ask questions. Why this? I want to explain everything to them. They all marvel. Take for example, I ask them simple. Do you know the salary of FCT in a month? The salary bill? Yes. How much? About 8.9 billion. Whoa. Right? That is not the pension and the rest of it. That is not other allowances you know, attached to it. Now, when you go to FAC, so many people say that FCT collects 1%. They don't ask 1% of what? Is it 1% of the money to be shared by the Federation in a month? Or 1% of what is allocated to the federal government? We don't collect 1% of the federation money, no. We collect 1% of what is allocated to the federal government. Ordinarily, it should have 1% of the entire federation. But as it is today, yeah. this is what is being collected. So if federal government collects 500 billion in a month yeah. from the federation account, what is 1% of 500 billion? Five billion. <laughs> mm. So we have salary of one, uh, eight point nine, mm. right? Now, have you uh, other things, have you factored in this new increment? But I'm, I'm just saying, yes, because it, like it's almost nine point now, now, nine point nine now. Okay. But if you also add this increment, mm -hmm. so that's now, more. Yes. Mm -hmm. Now it will even be more. Now. You don't ask yourself, how do you pay salaries? You fall back to what? Idea. There are countries that solely depend on the idea. Taxes. So you cannot say that what we are collecting now is illegal. No. All I explain to them, see where we are, see the situation. If you're not told, you have this assumption that there's so much money. I told you there's not so much money, but there's so much potential. Okay. Okay. Tell us which about... Which ought to be actualized. All right. Tell us about this idea. In the last three months, yeah. we've seen your effort to try... In trying to improve the revenue profile yeah. Yeah. of the FCT. Yeah. So we want to know what, where exactly are we and what are you doing to show it up? I can, I can tell you... Okay. Take for example. Over the years, nobody has been able to enforce the payment of grand rent. I came on board, I said, listen, it can't be business as usual. It can't be business as usual. You have property, you allocated CO4, you are given a CO4 to back up your property, and that CO4, you are told to be paying annual rent, grand rent, mm -hmm. of so so a month, say about 100,000 annually. For the past 15 years, you didn't pay. Some people, for the past 20 years, they've never paid. And you know Nigeria, nothing will happen. 
And I tell myself, no, something will happen. You have to pay. Yeah. If you don't pay... the FCT, uh, uh, previous accusations also culpable with this? Because if you... If your life I have told you, depends on how no, much you generate, no, and you are not I, making I, I, but, but, but first generate. of all, why are you saying previous uh, accusations? You yourself... It's a covenant. Why are you coming for someone to force you? You know, every year, like take for example, I'm a tenant, for example, and I'm supposed to be paying one million naira every year yes. as my rent. Yes. And the year has ended. If you're a good citizen, or if you're a good tenant, do you need your, uh, your landlord to begin to chase you when you know that your rent <laughs> is time for you to pay? No, you, you are not saying because the administration or previous administration yeah. did not come out to yeah, push you to pay. And now we have come out and we are saying, no, you have to pay. Yeah, you know when I came on board and said, look, if you don't pay, we are going to revoke. You know that people came out to say, look, you think that Abuja is a river state, this and that. I, said, <laughs> I know that Abuja is not river state. That is why they say here is Abuja and that place is a river, river state. state. You know, Nigerians are people that look, nobody wants to, but I say you must pay. Now, Seeing that, yes, we mean what we have said, if you don't pay, we will revoke. And we have been doing that, and people are not queuing up to pay. Go to the ages. People are queuing up. And that has not increased our IGR. Now, there are also other areas that we have not tapped in. So many, maybe the previous one said, you don't look into it. Property tax is there. Business gain tax is there. You see, as a government, it's your duty. So see the laws that allows you to raise funds for the governing of the area. So this decision we took is paying off. I can tell you, as at the time I came, what was being collected, about 12, 13, 14 billion. On, on property state. tax? Yes. No. no Agile. 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 Monthly? So, totally. Yes. Hmm. Totally. Monthly. It's not yearly, it's <laughs> monthly. <laughs> now, but what we have done today, we almost going to 20, 20, 20 something. Billion. Yes. And our idea now, before, when they pay IGI, they spend it daily. I said, no, we won't do that again. Every money paid to the IGI account till the end of the month. Right? If today, it will, the month this month will end tighted, right? Yes. At the end of the month, say by 3rd of December, we'll look at what is there. How much is there? 25 billion. Fine. Where are our priority projects? Attach this project to the sum of 4 billion, for example. Attach this project for the form of 3 billion. Attach the project for this. Pay to the contractors. Let them go back to, to, to work. Beautifully for us. Because the Mr. President, who I will see, know that governance, that must be a business, must be taken as uh, business like. You see abandoned projects in, in FCT everywhere. Mm -hmm. What was the cost? Lack of funding? Not just lack of funding, but we are not allowed to participate in a wider financial uh, transaction. All our money goes to CBN. All the IGR goes to CBN. Right? We can't borrow money from CBN. We can't borrow money from CBN. Now, what the, what the president did, the only way you can survive this, put them out from the TSA. Right? If you pull us out of the TSA, we can now go to the wider financial market. We can now just say, Bank A, listen, we need 200 billion to carry out our projects. How do you pay us? We'll attach our IGR to you. Right? Mm. Give us this 200 billion. Take Five billion, for example, from every the, month. From the IGR account. From the IGR account. To liquidate 
this 200 uh, billion. If we have 20 billion, for example, and the bank has given us 200 billion on front, and they are taking 5, 5 billion in order to liquidate the 200 billion, maybe in two, three, four years, right? Yeah. Hmm. We have applied this 200 billion for projects. That's the reverse model. Don't you? That's fine. Before you know, you have achieved all you wanted to achieve. Okay. But yeah. before, when this money was being paid to the central bank, yeah. we only take asset comes mm. and there was no meaningful use mm. for it. Okay. Could, mm. pardon me, could, could you clarify a little bit? When you spoke about property tax, are you saying the law currently allows you to collect property tax? Yes, or, very, well. very well. So you will enforce that now? Of course, we have already come out with the enforce the, the, uh, 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 the revenue board and the, and the economic planning department. Mm. They already work on it. They already uh, engaging with okay. the and the stakeholders. Okay. So the details of that, but whether it's a lie by law, yes. Okay. But with, with the enforcement of that policy, where a human face, in the sense, I mean, taking into consideration that uh, there's enough blame to go around the two parties there, uh, the defaulters and the uh, MCT administration, not necessarily your administration, previous administrations that didn't see the compulsion in, in this. Yeah, when you talk about human face, I, I yeah. I, for instance, if I'm owing like for 15 years, yeah, and no, no, calculate no, no, what no, I'm owing no, no, 15 no, no, years, it will be human to ask me to no, pay no, once. No, no, we are not collecting property tax retroactively. Retroactive. No, 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 no. Okay, it is starting now. We are not saying over the years. No, no, we are not doing that. Okay, we are not doing that. So that people don't. Okay, but let's just. I was just wondering, pardon me, please. You know, when you also mentioned C of O, now and that you also go back for those who will come for revalidation. Recertification. So, recertification. Yeah. I, I read somewhere where you were speaking about you having been given fake C of O. No, 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 no let me tell you what, what you found there. Not mm. giving me. As a state government, when I was a governor, not giving me. Okay. I thought about a state government applied. And we they thought, gave the state government fake C of O. Yes. And we thought that we had a property or property. So, in fact, my last officer then <laughs> brought a certificate. Three. Behold, they were fake. <laughs> so, if you so provided the existence, but was given to us okay. here. So, what, what is going on? So, so what, is what if someone comes for recertification now? Yeah. And then the person finds out, or the agency that, that finds what out, they was what they were giving was fake. What do they do? This is this it this themselves or the FCD that will be culpable? No, first of all, when you say, well, what I mean by fake, there's no such property. Okay. Oh. There's no such property at all, but they have given us CFO. Hmm. That's the point I'm trying to make. Okay. How do you give me a CFO when there's no it property? Does, does. It doesn't exist. That suggests a deeper problem. That uh, is what, uh, that's what both in the to... ages and mm. probably in some other now, places. You see, you see, when you have come to make some changes, you know, one thing you must find in us human beings, we don't like changes. But change is inevitable. People want things done the same way. There are people who benefit from it. As I can, you, you must also know there will be a fight against it. Mm -hmm. Now, this position you are taking, people will fight against it. But I was resolute. I was resolute. And I said, it doesn't matter. You go to your social media, say whatever you want to say. I must implement these changes. Mm -hmm. Now, take, a, take for example, how government, the land belongs to government. Government says, I'm going to bring out 400 hectares of land. Government says, I'm going to provide infrastructure where FCT has awarded a contract to provide infrastructure in that 500 hectares of land to the tune of 86 billion naira. We, we, we have the land. We provide funds. Now, they want to enter into agreement, listen, to developers, according to them, for the developer to uh, build affordable houses. Mm. I don't know who define affordable houses. Mm. And sell. No one that comes to government. Have you, have you ever seen that? I brought the land. I brought the money. 
to devote to provide infrastructure. Then you now come and tell me that you want to build and sell, according to you, affordable uh, houses. No problem. What is our own benefit? So you sell for, you take 100% profit, and, I mean, I said no. I said no. Do you know, when I said I will cancel this transaction, who are the beneficiaries? The civil servants, the staff, there are those who are telling you they will build affordable. Who determines what is affordable? So when I called them, that I was going to cancel this. If you see the way the director in charge of that project, it's like she should faint. I said, Madam, what's happening to you? So I said, Okay, you go cancel that. I said, What do you mean, okay? It's cancelled. I said, can't give me the file. Do you know, immediately I left office here, calls from everywhere. I said, what kind of, what kind of country are we in? Did you succumb? Succumb? I have already appended my signature. Why do I succumb to such a thing? I, you, 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 know, you know, it is very, it is, I, I, I laugh. Another thing that happened, you know, in this place, you find out the way our people think. Sometimes they go ethnic. Because I'm an Igbo man. Because I'm an Afghan. Because I'm a Yoruba man. Then if that can work, they go to religion. He's doing this thing because I'm a Muslim. He's doing this because I'm a Christian. The only people who that are not going to say, is that I don't worship God. That's why he's doing this. But he must show leadership. He must be firm. I said, this is what I'm going to do. I came, I saw a file. FCT entered into an agreement with a developer. I don't know how, you know how, and then in that contract, Everything is going to charge, we will pay to the contractor some charges, on land charges, this is Katakbe. And the federal government approved that contract for this developer to provide infrastructure. Mm -hmm. And the contract sum was 61 billion. Now, somehow, the business collapsed. Part of the problem was from the contractor. Why? He said he took funds from bank, and because the the the, the FCT was not paying their own part, that the charges they are supposed to collect from the amortis. But the FCT said, "No, we will be giving you. We will say bank pay him this because this is the milestone he has uh, done. He can't be collecting money from bank." No, if not done to this, I'm a bank is paying you money. We should be the one to say that you have done this milestone. Therefore, pay him this. So somewhere, no. mm. you know what? How they got it and agreed? The contract are closed. That LCD should not pay back to them fifty-eight billion. Look, I had migraine. What are the percentage of the job done? Twenty-three percent. I said, ah, what kind of, what kind of business? And Federal Executive Council approved it. I said, Federal Executive Council approved that we should pay fifty-eight billion of the contract of sixty-one billion. That only twenty-three percent was done. They said, no, it's just that the uh, Minister of Finance will pay them, then we the deduct. I said, what is Minister of Finance? It's still we. It's the FCT. So, as someone, they, so you know how, how, how this place operates. I called the, the, those who were in charge. I said, you people succumb to this and sign this. I should 
Now I am here. I fifty billion. I called the FC Internet Council. Let's look. <laughs> Let's discuss about this. You, General Council, your lawyer, yes? You. You. Tell me. So, 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 tell me. Are you telling me that if you are sitting in this table, or I'm sitting on this table, on this chair, you will yeah, pay the company? And when you will finish that meeting, all my friends are calling me. Ah, oh boy, you know, this thing, you have to take it easy. It's not, it's not your father's job, you know. I say, which one is not my father's job? So clearly there's, there's mm -hmm. corruption involved in that matter. You can see. Look, it is terrible. If, look, sometimes you wonder whether we can come out of this. Mm. And you will be blackmailed. You will be blackmailed. Sometimes I see certain payment. That's what is this? But this particular what? issue, how did you end? Yeah, of course, I'm taking it back to the Federal Council. Okay. To so council? Yes, yeah, so to for review. Yeah. Yes, I, I, I will take it back. For... I will take, let them look at it. Okay. Are, are you, are you I, prepared a, a convincing brief? Leave that, that for, leave, that, for fair? Leave, leave that for me. Since fair took the, I don't need the to tell you whether I'm going back to fair. You don't need to ask me whether I prepared a convincing. Uh, uh, yeah, because uh, it's so like fair overruling itself. Am I going to carry people to fair take? Fair overruling itself. What is the. I mean, uh, the council can review previous decisions. Mm -hmm. but, of, but of course, it's true. You can award a contract and come back to say no. This contract is about to look into it. Mm -hmm. I don't know if it's not something will go ahead. So mm -hmm. many things have happened. So many things have happened. That, it's just that we want to move on. Okay, ask yourself a question. Why, before I came, why was it that contractors were not on site? Simple. You consulted paying money in irregularities. You said there were variations. If, I don't want to go into the issue of variation. It is alarming. With my experience, former as a, as a minister, I can tell you this authority too. Government prices are higher in contracts than any other thing. I can tell you that three times. Let me tell you. Contractors have this impression, which is sometimes correct, that government don't pay on time. Mm. So they put all together. So even if they don't pay in two, three years, they are still within their... But again, without you knowing, within that two, three years, they come back for variation. variation. Mm -hmm. When they come to me, I say, hey, see them. You know, I was a minister here. You know, I was a governor. Tell me, this price you are giving me here, one kilometer road here, mm. which is in a dry land, lat right, it's much more high than one kilometer road I do rivers. Even with a very of the, the portable contractors. We use Sharpson. We use uh, Big uh, Smith. And you are using just ordinary uh, lat right here on dry land. Mm. And look at the cost. I said, no, I'm not going to accept this. I'm not going to accept this. The only thing you can hold me responsible, am I paying? Which, of course, I will pay. Honorable Minister, um, we, we had this discussion the last time. You know, we just mentioned it, you know, a little bit earlier in the discussion, and that is the huge wage bill of the FCT. You just mm -hmm. mentioned that, you know, the new arithmetic is pushing it up to, to, to 10 billion, if you say 9.9. Uh, is that an albatross, for instance, for your work? That is one. Then two, are you considering, because I think you were alarmed even when it was about eight billion when you were talking to resident doctors. Are you looking at perhaps also reviewing why it has gotten to that number? I, 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 I have to say this. I came and I said we are going to do forensic audit of staff. Mm. Let's actually know this number of uh, staff. I just uh, three months Three days ago, three months as I was appointed, 
And you know you can't carry everything at the same time. You take it one after the other. But you know our people, and what will happen? By the time you will do this now, Labour will come with politics. I mean, it's alarming that FCT should have this number of stamps for this um, um, wage bill. I can't believe it. Do you have the numerical strength? Um, I'm told it's about 38,000. <laughs> so, so, ethnicity will come. Religion will come. Politics will come in. But thankfully, you tell you won't succumb, so you will go ahead and do it. No, I won't. Go. Like I've told you, anything I say I will do, I will do it. You see, the moment I have the backing of an princess and president, and he said, go ahead with this. I will go ahead. Uh, because why do, you, why do I do that always? Politics will come in. Yeah. Politics will come in. Oh, you know it's not a member of my party. Oh, it's time to spoil the image. You know those kind of things. Politics will come in. Ethnicity will come in. The other big instrument, religion will come in. They will, they will fire you religion, they will fire you politics, they will fire you uh, ethnicity. And then all sorts of campaign. They even go to bishops. They go to imams. To issue statements. <laughs> to issue statements. And 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 you just say look. Yeah, but Honourable Minister, if there isn't any, uh, if there are no measures to ensure that look, because you complained about the wage bill variations, things not going on right, yeah. and corruption in different places. But if we haven't heard or see measures to ensure that, look, if people keep embarking on this kind of thing, they will face the music. They will feel there's no reason why they shouldn't do it again tomorrow. First of all, I didn't come here to prosecute anybody. If I say this thing will not continue, mm -hmm. and somebody wants to continue with it, then you have given me room to say, no, I won't allow this. You have to face the... But I wouldn't have said, oh, this is what they did before. Then let me go and post it. But even by you doing that, you may not be able to go on with your job. So you are drawing a line. Yes, I'm focused. But I said, okay, it happened yesterday. It will not continue to happen uh, today. Mm -hmm. if, it, if it continues, it fails the right of the law. So you have drawn a line on of all course, of those of issues. Course. And uh, do, I, do I add the issue of land grabbing as well? Multiple allocations of land. Can, 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 can I tell you? That was the case I was settling. FCT allocated the land to one of the companies in 2001. Over 300 hectares. 2001. Revoked it in 2002, thereabouts. I reallocated it to another company. Right? Mm -hmm. In 2005, we revoked it. I didn't go to the initial to the, to the first assessment <laughs> without giving notice to the allocation. So even the, the, the second person that was allocated. Then in 2009, he revoked that again and allocated to another company. Oh the third God. company? Oh my God. 300 acres. Let's yes. have, you know, you know. You know, and one of them, I have known him very well. This time he gets he gets a court order against self city over land. So I sat there. I was to them. I said you. I know you. I said it will not happen again. Last week, God keeping us alive. I will not get the legal team external solicitors who have arranged over twenty five senior advocates to defend the city on our land matters. You know what happens here? Even the this legal secretary will tell you to sue. They will sue and they will not defend it. They won't go to court. It's business, it's like a theory. They won't go to court. So you say judgment against self city. Judgment. I said, what is going on here? I said, okay. Give me all the files. Yes, it will be expensive for us. But 
we must do it in a way that it will also help us. Mm. We are going to pay the bill to a science residence. Nobody will go and compromise them. You go and study under them. We have Director Liga in Aegis. Director Liga in FCD. Then we have Solicitor sort of General here and we have General Counsel here with lawyer. Now, when they sue FCD, they serve them. They sue me, they serve them there. The lawyer will sign. Well, my office will not know that I've been sued. Mm. Because FCD is still FCT. I said, ah, no, no, I won't do this again. Everybody collapse. You have only one legal secretary. I don't want to legal representatives. Everybody collapse. Come here. Be under the general uh, council. Of course. Whoa, whoa, why would I have for this and that? Oh, yeah. They even tell them now to sue me so that the matter will linger on that I will, in the next three, four years, I'm out. So there's like a cartel. It's a cartel. Like people doing this. I'm afraid to bust that cartel. It must be very, very prepared. Mm. And for me, I'm prepared. I will face it. It doesn't matter. Okay. If, if you like, buy all the blogs anywhere in the world to say this about me. I don't, I don't even bother myself. Yes, I know I'm being right. Your Excellency, um, if we move a little bit from the obstacles to some of the possibilities, uh, we're seeing you know, some infrastructure being put in place, road, for mm -hmm. instance, driving into this place, uh, we'll see some heavy duties around that. You, you, was it two days ago or three days ago you had a tour? Um, you've seen some of the you know, jobs. Uh, what, are, what is your assessment? Are you still, you know, do you still have the same feelings uh, in our first uh, interview in terms of whipping people to shape to make sure that, uh, you know, um, the jobs are delivered on time or are you, uh, you know, no, interested no, no, in what no, is happening? No, no, no. Uh, 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 we also hear that some of these projects are actually on timeline for commissioning yes. next year by yes, Mr. Yes, President yes, yes. for his first time. Now, you see, we, we, we're all giving targets. Mr. President has set targets. And we have signed that, we want to understand it, deliverables. Mm -hmm. For me, Mr. President, we one year, May 29. Mm -hmm. I'm not going to be one year. It's not me that's celebrating. But Mr. President is celebrating, I'm celebrating, right? Now, what are you celebrating? What can you say for the people of Abuja, for the city? what have you done? Mr. President, then he will look at me, Minister. How far? How far? <laughs> How far? What can you show? Sir, so, yes, yes, yes. We can show a lot of things, sir. Infrastructure wise, sir, so, yes. We can show this. And so, I saw one of the companies. You, you want my money? When I mean my money, I'm not my personal money. You know, people will go and say, I said my money, my money. But since I'm the one representing FCT. Yes. How long can you finish this job? Sir, if you give us this money, we can finish it. April ended. Yeah, sure? Okay. General Counsel, come. What? Put an agreement. I'm going to be giving you one billion naira every month. Are you satisfied? Yes, sir. I'm going to give you four billion naira every month. Are you satisfied? Yes, sir. I'm going to give five billion. Are you satisfied? Yes, sir. Fine. Well, put it. Agreement. Sign. I know what that has done. It has given them confidence. In fact, without even they come. Sir. Even the ones you have not added here, we are going to work. We know you will pay. And what have I done now? I've written to Mr. President about supplementary budget so as we will be able to pay these contractors and finish the job before May 29.
We are not asking them, we have the money now. Do you understand me? We have the money, but we can't spend it. Because it was not... Projects are national budget, that have been funded by national budget. There are projects that are statutory budget, that have been funded through the statutory uh, budget. So, take for example, the VP's residence that was awarded 2007. Two, two, 2010. 13 good years. 13 good years. Abandoned. I called you the bigger. Can you feed this for me? He said, yes. Okay. But now that project ought to be national budget. We have to bring it to a statutory budget so I can finish that project by, uh, before May 29. Mm. The one which the developer is constructing, B1, B4, I mean B6. Can you finish it? Yes, sir. How much do you need? Six billion. Okay. See the way we pay it. Sign. It's almost. They are rushing it. They are rushing it. To finish it. Where do you want to be 12? Which will be finished by that very moment of the flavor. Latest November next year. Mm. We have the one here, the villa where you see CGC mm. with four, uh, four, um, four uh, um, links. links. Yes, by CGC to be finished by before May 29. Mm. There's one set of is doing that goes to the Christian Economic Center, mm. it will finish. So, some of the projects are going to be finished. The access roads to the metro line will all be finished. Mm -hmm. Mr. Does your ministerial so, so, MOU so, require that, you that's to? Minute. The minister didn't give us the, 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 the supplementary budget. The, 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 for the which one? Size of the supplementary budget. No, it, we, 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 we he, asked. He talked about this, we asked for president to transmit. Wow. Your approval was just to transmit to the national government. A sixty-one billion. Sixty-one billion. This that's is one the total package. Like a yes, is tied. To, to specific projects. projects. Tied to specific projects which we want to launch by the grace of God. Mm. When President would tell Nigerians, mm. one year in office, mm. what I've been able to do. Okay. I don't want to lag behind. I don't want to because, because the President, who is, he, he, he is, he, he, he is here in Abuja, and then he, he, would, ask, he would say, Minister Dix, what can we show for my one year in office? Does that, it, what can you say? Does, so that, does, that MOU, say. does that MOU require you to deliver on such projects, projects every year? Yeah, of course. Mm -hmm. Every minister to. must deliver every year. Yeah. Well, uh, you see, some people will say first quarter, third quarter, whatever. Mm -hmm. But I think it's yearly. Mm -hmm. You cannot, I mean, you, you, you must have to show mm -hmm. in every year what I've been able to put down. Yeah. Arable minister in and then at the end of the year, and at the, uh, at the end of the four years, Mr. President will be able to say, while I was in office for four years, this was what I was able to do. Take it sectorially. I'm talking about... Sectorally. The, Honorable Minister, in terms of uh, deliverables, yes. and uh, you, you, when we, the President made a comment about the Metro Line, you just mentioned the side yes, yes, He said he wants to ride fine, on the Metro Line. Fine. And I did promise to Mr. President that, look, we are ready. You are going to ride on this... Uh, uh, metro line. But we have the snag, which I, I have uh, written to him. The snag is this. The award of the contract we are done Naira component and dollar component. It's unfortunate. Now, we, are, we don't have problem in terms of the Naira component. We have problem in terms of the dollar component. So, so look, sir, I don't know where city will go and get uh, Seven million dollars to pay to uh, what do you call it? Uh, C C C C C C. The the Nara company will have the money, so I've written to him to intervene, which I believe, because it's a major project, and that's why we're rushing the access uh, mm -hmm. roads mm -hmm. so that communities can have access to the to the train uh, station. Are you delivered that in four years? Which uh, four years or one year? Four years. He's talking one about year. one year. Yeah. The access roads. 
Yes, no, the, the, real, the real project. The president. This is the project. If the president would add on it in May 29. Mm. That's why we are. In fact, I have written to the Minister of Finance. I said, listen, the supplementary budget of 2023, national budget, which Mr. President has assented to, mm. I have written to the Minister of Finance, give us our money because. These projects are time targeted. Mm. Right? If you don't give up, we told Mr. President eight months. Right? And we have lost two months. So we have about six months. Mm. So we need this money now so that we'll be able to execute on time, which is one of the deliverables we must uh, give up. If uh, I could just follow up on that transport bit. Mm. Yes. What plan do you have and when will FCT, FCT residents get a mass transit okay. system? Good, good news for you. <laughs> December, we are launching vehicles for the mass transit. December? Uh, December. Um, again, it's part of the statutory, uh, it's part of the um, the supplementary budget was submitted from Mr. President to transmit to the, to mm -hmm. the National Assembly. Mm -hmm. They funded there so that we can. We have already anticipated the, 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 the National Assembly will uh, uh, pass it. We have, we have started doing the uh, procurement process so that as it comes, we will not be delayed. So. Like I said, we have the money in our account. All we are seeking for is a, a approval, I mean, a passage by the National uh, Assembly for us to be able to spend. How many are we looking at here? Both buses and taxis put together, blah, 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 for the, for the first phase. Mm. We will not get the first phase we are doing, it will be restricted. Within Abuja, Maitama areas, all these um, Yaliki, we say, you know, because we want to stop this one chance. Mm. Okay. They, they there will no more opportunity for one chance because you don't have it. Why would you go and enter any taxi that is not uh, the, uh, Abuja uh, uh, the transport system? Why would you do that? Then you are the one looking for your. Uh, uh, for the problem. So will the buses be CNG buses? Well, no, the CNG will come. This is the normal buses and normal taxis. Mm -hmm. We have been painted in um, Abuja. Mm -hmm. uh, you, now, those buses or taxis will ply, you know when you go to Asokoro, where you see all these kakene, kakene mm -hmm. we are going to phase them out. Mm -hmm. Remember I said before, why would we not allow, why would we allow them? Because there is no alternative. Now we are providing a uh, alternative. With all due respect, we can't allow that. Are you doing that immediately? I said we are going to launch it in December. And so face, facing them out. By, by, by January, they should be out. So wait, what about those they of them that out. can? We, we, I'm not talking about the entire Abuja now. Okay. Okay. So okay. you take, so take it face by face, okay. area by area. For me, my time I'm so called, all these are, you see, when people come outside of the country. That's, that's, like, that's like the municipal. Uh -huh. Yes. Mm. And uh, the, the, the impression they get, uh, what kind of city is this? It's not organized. You so see, will you allow that. those of them who can transit from probably Kekenapep to also integrate into this next phase so of you don't course, have too many the, people? If they are good drivers, we'll employ them to be part mm. of it. Mm. But the people okay. should understand mm. that we must make it as a city. There's mm. no sentiment about it. It's not something about, oh, you want to make people not to have the economy life. No, 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 no. Mm. We'll face it out to where you can operate, but not mm. within the city. All right. Now, we're also putting to repairs all the our buses that have been parked there for nobody know number of years. Mm. We're we are, we are spending over almost 600 million dollars to put them in place. Oh. And then those buses will now come out. To apply to put like areas like Yaya, yeah, yeah. mm. you understand me? Areas. And the satellite towers. All those areas. 
Well, 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 the rest of them, put them there. All right. Those who are coming to work will have the opportunity to apply this a luxurious buses. Right. Don't go into all these yaya. We have the opportunity to buy those luxurious buses. Okay. Uh, but again, like I said, we, this is no political statement. It's a statement of reality yeah. that we are ready. We are ready. Honorable right, Minister, we need to go on a quick break. Yeah. About two, three minutes. We'll be right back. And of course, that gives us some uh, breather as well. So we we'll go on a quick break. We'll be right back. Welcome back to our special interview with the Honorable Minister of the FCT, Nyesi Ongwike. I'm here with my colleagues from AIT, NTA and TVC, all here to get the Minister to respond to some questions, including the ones that you will prefer. Honorable Minister, I saw a woman from a distance fall into a manhole here in the FCT. I know you put up a committee some time ago to do something. She was safe because people had to rush there to bring her out. And I know somebody else who was also injured as a result of this manhole. What's going on? What are you doing about that? Again, that tells us that all of us owe responsibility to government. Government alone cannot. Look at how government has constructed road. Provided for security, uh, the manhole, where they would use for repairs of in terms of water uh, line and uh, um, power line. The same people, Nigerians, that are supposed to use to say, look, we appreciate what government is doing. We're going to steal this manhole. Some of us, you will see somebody doing that. You won't even go and report to the security agencies. So we have a task force who have been doing quite well. We have prosecuted, arrested, we have arrested and we are prosecuting them. We don't come out to say we this is uh, well, the police uh, the other security agencies don't come out every day to say oh we have arrested this number, we have prosecuted this number. They do it collectively and say maybe in every one month the let members of the public know. But we have devised another strategy. In fact, that was when I went to visit, is it the, the Southern Park Lane of the Royal uh, CGC? Is it CGC? No. No, it's a Setaco. I went to visit that project, and then I showed me the new way they are now doing the man that uh, you, you cannot take it away. It will be difficult. Just to discourage uh, these boys, or uh, discourage theft of the man. But it's, it's, quite, it's quite embarrassing. It's quite embarrassing. And then something. again, we're also going after those who buy it from them. How? People buy it from them. Can you trace them? I mean, Of course, when you arrest them, they do an investigation, they, they link you to uh, where it is sold. And then we also arrest those uh, who buy them. Are you aware that this mm -hmm. has also extended to street lights? Yeah. <laughs> Solar-powered street lights. There's nothing Nigerians cannot do. But it's unfortunate. We we'll spend money, street lights for you to, to beautify the place. You want to check insecurity. You see people at 2, 2 a.m. Security men cannot be everywhere. But that's why the Senate debated about CCTV. They asked you, the FCT minister, they to do ask, something. They never asked me. What did they say? Please, I'm not, I'm not even aware of anything <laughs> called the CCTV. Nobody has brought it to my... Uh, because you need that. Yeah. For no, security. No, what about it? First of all, you also have to talk about the funding. Yeah, but you'll be able to see the files. We haven't seen any file that has to do with agreements, uh, contract agreements. What? Of I, 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 like you said, you said the Senate is proving. I mean, when they write for me to appear, then I will have the facts to go and present. But the point I'm making is that CCTV is good, but it has to be done in, uh, in conjunction with, say, the DGSS, the National Security Advisor. And the funding is also key. I don't just go into a project because I want people to know that I'm going to the project. I'm going to a project, yes, it's important, but is the funding there? If the funding is there, why not? Just like, take for example, you award a contract of 100 billion. 
Then in the budget, you provide a, a one billion. What kind of project is that? How will it go? How many years? That project will not see the light of the day. How would I, how would I say I'm a one project uh, contract of 44 billion? And it's supposed to last two years. Then in your yearly uh, budget, you provide uh, a two billion. That's the year budget, two billion. And I year, two billion, four billion. When we were talking about 44 billion. And before you know, the value will come. So, first of all, I have to take stock. How much is this going to cost me? Let me see the financial aspect and the technical aspect. The workability. Do you understand me? And then you must also tell me because the funding is there, I'm in a range, this contract will last me two, three years. Any project I cannot complete now, this opportunity I have, I won't start it. Let's talk about so, but, but the issue of CCTV is key, mm. but it has to be done in conjunction yeah. with the National Security Officer's Office and the 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 DG SSS. SSS. So, what 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 we are doing now? I've already hinted the DG SSS that look, we need to sit down and work out this uh, CCTV. I don't want to go back to the old contracts and all kind of things. Mm. If, I, if I do that, I won't control what I want to do. Just like I was telling you about the contracts that were awarded, left hand and center, no budgeting, nothing. And then, uh, look at the whole entire Gusapi. I was just looking at it five years ago. You gave me migraine, 120 billion. That's one contract. So how many years are you projected for that contract? Uh, two billion right some, 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 oh, uh, I oh, my king. Oh, you know, uh, my son, you know, I live in Sape, there are no infrastructure there. Yes, I agree with you. What about the money? But you're crying now, uh, we're well, saying that they should pay so, so amount of money for uh, Shepo. Where well, do we get the money to do all these projects? Look at the um, uh, Emilion Center, such an edifice that would have showcased the city of Abuja, was awarded under a passenger at the cost of how much? 50 something billion, right? Beautiful. It has a basement that would take 2,000 cars to showcase our cultural traits, everything. I went there. I wanted under our messenger. Few something billion. They were paying piece me, piece me. They paid up to forty something billion. Project abandoned. Since two thousand and one. I went two thousand and twenty now. Yes. How many years? Mm -hmm. How many years? Twenty two years. Twenty two years. Will you, will you revisit it? Mm -hmm. Of course. It's one of the signature projects that Mr. President will go home with. Of mm. course. Now, what did I do? I went there. I shook my head. So I called the company. I think there's um, a Salini. Now, they have done variation before I came of another something, something billion. <laughs> Making it one or something a billion. What do I do? But it's a major project that this city needs. It will be a tourist center. So I call the company and send them down. This project, how many years can you finish it if you have money? They say that, well, everything is about now 80 billion. Yes, uh, we can finish it in two years. Two years? Yeah, sure. I said, I'll give you two years and six months. How do we pay? Fine. That's okay. 
If I give you three billion every month, in a year it's times six billion, you know. Mm -hmm. In another year it's six billion, it's not two billion. Mm -hmm. What more fish? Are you willing to do that? Now we agree we'll pay them from October, we'll pay them three, three billion, which is December, nine billion. I have the nine billion, so it's part of some budget I submitted to President. Please transfer to the, uh, 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 what's it called? Um, National Assembly, so that they can pass it, so that we can pay this company nine billion. The already on site now. It's a major project that Mr. President will show case to Nigerians. Mm -hmm. I told you that I have in my own is you need hope agenda. Everybody had lost hope. Hmm. Let's talk about So it's not so if you present that kind of project to residents of Abuja. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean you've given people hope oh so really That's so Abuja should not be like other That's cities other of the cities. of the world. Well, we know there are a lot of things to be done, but it's a project. Yes, it's so. It's so. If if you don't take care, it's so big, but uh, very ambitious, very ambitious. But it's achievable, and I'm going to achieve it. Very ambitious, but it's achievable, and I'm going to achieve it. Welfare now. Yes. Sir. Welfare of FCT workers. Yeah. Mm. Things are not looking up like how? in terms of. Inflation rates and everything. Well, the what have you have we, have we not increased the salary? Yeah. What have you done? What have you done apart from? What will you do? First of all, we try to help in terms of palliatives. This this uh, yield tool that we probably will provide something. Now, take for example, one thing they all want, which we have done, is where there's no hope for them to grow. The FCT no hope the, for them to grow. The FCT civil for all the years, yes. Hmm. They've all suffered. They are all, no, 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 had the permission come here. So, when I asked Mr. President, he said, look, I don't, the law is there. Well, why is it that nobody wants to implement it? You know why? Power tussle. What is the power tussle? With all due respect, it's not personal. It shouldn't be personal. But every head of service has refused that. Why? You want to be in charge of posting of permanent secretaries to a city. Every head of service that has come. That's why we say it shouldn't be personal. Look at the law passed by National Assembly. People cannot get to permanent secretary level. They cannot get to. But Mr. President saw it and said, look, no, we can't do this. This is people's life career. Mm. Why do you, you know, make them not to grow? Mm. He said, look, go and implement it. Go and set up the civil service uh, commission. Mm. The day that was announced, go and see the jubilation. Mm. Oh, I can grow now. Is it up and running mm. already? Just, well, just take it state by state. So level 17 you officer can come. Just yep. one month. You don't just the, the next day. No. You get office for them. You, you, you have to make sure they should be ready. Mm -hmm. But what is important is that approval has been given. You must implement. Mm -hmm. If there are challenges, we will not look at how to solve those uh, challenges. It does. So no that problem. alone gives them joy. Do you know that, that as you, somebody stampeds you do not to grow mm -hmm. in your career? Mm -hmm. what, can, what is the motivation for you to work? What, what welfare can you give me? What increment of salary can you give me, uh, give me that, I can, that when I cannot grow? No. That alone gives them satisfaction. So when you say welfare of uh, 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 workers, I don't know, you want us to pay your children's school fees? <laughs> No, tell me because so there are some allowances that they've not paid, paid, and why do you no, have delays in salaries? No, there are no delays in salaries. With due respect, there are no delays in salaries. Salaries are paid as at when due. Allowances are paid as when due. The bring the file I approve is paid. So those are the entitlements. You cannot deny them. 
But there are some ones that don't agree, not allowances, travels. Let me tell you. I came here, somebody said they had approval to travel to study land administration in America. What is that? I mean, what is that? To go and study land uh, uh, in America? What? How does that? How, how does, if you say you are going to Lagos to look at how their land administration is working, did you understand me? Mm. I, will, I, will, I will approve. The system of America, federal system, organized well, is it what is done here? Even the law says FCT should be treated as a state. Even though it's a federal capital territory, people treat it as MDA. We're not MDA. We have our own commissioners, which is commanded secretaries. We have our own general counsel, who's like attorney general. We have a solicitor, who's like a solicitor general of the state of the federal government. But when it comes to alliance activities, oh, no, no, no. Even later communication, the communication later story, they refer to MDA. Well, <laughs> so I told the young man, I said, look, you know the way you me, you just feel that you want to give me a bad name. That, oh, I have a program to travel to America. Oh, this kind of minister self. Uh, if you smart, smart thing I will make from there. I said, look, look, it doesn't make sense. If you want me to dash your money, I will find money and dash your money. But don't tell me that you are going to America to learn about land administration. You know, I mean, it's not convincing to me. So he came back. Sasa, help me. <laughs> and you see the approval as well. He said, the former minister gave him I said, so why didn't you travel since that time? You know, I don't allow this type of thing. I don't allow it. That's okay. You have to. I didn't have to. That's okay. He said, approval that has been made. But the point that I'm making is, those ones, when you come, I will not agree. I will not agree. Just like I told you, let's go the right answer. Listen. This is a pattern of budget, it won't work. It will not work. I'm going to do 70, 30. 70 capital, 30. To record. Look, we can't spend all our money recording, recording. Mm -hmm. People, you see, I went to <coughs> N20, being done by Gilmore, who's one of the real Mr. President of Commission. Look at the happiness as I came for inspection. Look at the happiness. I asked them, are you happy to say it? So why, sir? This road, the contractor don't come out with the sofa. Now, sir, she don't come now. See the road now, don't come back. I said, see him. Don't be with me, I tell her, I say, pray and say, then we'll bring back the hope. Look at that. They say, yeah, they don't see him now. Now, I want something for that people will see that the administration has done. Are the women happy? Mm -hmm. The women of Abidjan? Well, Particularly we after you have given them a mandate no, secretary no for women affairs. Has, we don't have anything to call women, no department, nothing. And, I mean, part of the problem but is inclusivity. How can you do governance? Women are not involved. So, I, I wrote to Mr. President, it's, inclusivity is part of your priority. You don't need to discriminate. He approved and appointed a uh, mandate secretary for women affairs. Do you know the jubilation of that? So now we can take our own case, our own problems, to the women secretary for them to solve our problem. We're in ESCO. You have a woman also talking about women, talking about youth, making provision to cater for them. And Mr. Let's just take, uh, stay a little bit with the 70-30, you know, scenario yeah. that you have created. Yeah. You, have, you have been called Mr. Project. Yeah. Uh, you're doing existing projects. That's projects that have been approved before, and you are making sure that they are, you know, finalized. Are you initiating some as well? Well, well. Uh, see, and let, let me take yes, the second yes, one on board. We're, 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 we're initiating some. Take for example. I don't know why we should stay under this kind of roof. When I was chairman of council, my office is better than this place. Oh, this, this particular room? Yes. Oh. How will anybody not contemplate as FCT, the headquarters of the, of the country? So, 
We are coming up with Telfro. We are negotiating with George Bega. That's a project. Mm -hmm. And it's a project that Mr. President will, you know, I can't see Minister of FCC stay in this country. You, you look at the environment. Are you trying to make FCC mm -hmm. like a mega city? Mm -hmm. Let it be a city that people will say, yeah, this is a city. I don't want to use the word mega. Mm -hmm. But let it be a city that people will say, have you been to Abuja and see it? The second part of I'm that. I'm not in a competitive uh, mood with anybody. This then, there's yeah. a life camp. You, you know the uh, life camp? That's where we yeah. have the seat of government. You know the, the, the life camp? Yes. Mm. The traffic there is something else. Mm. So we're coming to, we're do, uh, do, um, dualizing the road. I saw the, the, uh, the width, 52 meters. I said, no, it's too expensive for me to go. And so I think. It is to 32 uh, 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 meters. Yes. There's nothing wrong in 52, but you're also talking about the cost. The, 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 the cost. So, that is a project that will be part of uh, 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 our own uh, 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 budget. This year. Again, we are planning to build terminal bus uh, centers. We'll start with three. So that all these problems of all these taxes and this and that, no, we have to reduce it. So when you have these bus terminals, you want to travel to Yaya, you go to the bus terminal. You want to travel to Sobe, you go to so, so bus uh, terminal. Let us see that the place is a city, is well organized. I know it is difficult. I know it is difficult, but with determination, with the commitment, and with the backing of Mr. President, we will achieve it. Is that part of what we should expect in December as well? Yeah. No, no, no. You can't do the three bus terminals. You can start with one. No. Well, I see I don't promise what I will not uh, fulfill. It will be the budget of next year. You have been, both, you have been receiving some uh, ambassadors. Yes. Uh, uh, what has been the takeaway from the ones that well, you have met no, from well, Kuba? From... For, for me, yes, first of all, as a landlord, uh, convention demands that they will come and pay a uh, uh, council call. I owe that responsibility to provide uh, security and conducive uh, environment for them. Some of them may have some problems that relate with FCT that we need to solve as a foreign uh, uh, agent, as a foreign body. Mm -hmm. And then again, how we are going to partner in certain areas, think like, for example, uh, tourism. Yeah. Uh, we met with the chairman of the WU worldwide who came here and who indicated that they want to partner with us. And one of the things we agreed was we want to establish a five-star hotel, right? more class and what is our own road to provide the land for them. Yeah. We also um, we are going to uh, I was told I'm going to be part of the delegation with, uh, with President to go to the UAE. Uh, part of what we are doing is that they also want to build a seven star hotel. In fact uh, the team came in yesterday and then we will have further discussion when we get to United Arab Emirates. Then some have agreed to partner with us in terms of vocational and skill uh, uh, education and then agriculture. Uh, but, but I've always said this. Mine is not just visiting me, signing. I want uh, tell me that we have to commence for so-so time. We have to commence. So uh, uh, we are going to have a visit back to the countries uh, to you know sign with this, some of the uh, companies that have indicated uh, 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 interest. We also go to Korea um, to finalize with the Wu on this uh, uh, faster uh, uh, hotel. So it's been, I will say for now, it's been very positive and we believe more will come and it's part of what we're supposed to do. Just a uh, last one on your project. That will be the last um, question um, before yeah. we move yes, to politics. Yes, mm -hmm. but that, yes. the last one. Um, Your Excellency, you've talked about, you know, projects that uh, you can quickly achieve. But long term, in terms of this issue of uh, taking Abuja all, um, when we look at the population, the metro line as it is now, terminates at church gate. <laughs> the metro line as it is terminates near the church gate here from the airport if you are coming in. No, it starts yeah. from the... It starts from the, the, yeah, yes. the church gate. Yes. That's what it is. It passes through a lot of communities. Yes. Yes. So uh, there, there, are, there are train stations. Yes. Take like, for example, you do... Like that, yes. like that could be. Mm -hmm. so. My question is, in the dream, perhaps, you know, down the line, 
would you be thinking of perhaps uh, it's extending to the other side no, it's where it, the it's population it's, it's supposed to go from the Ecuador down to Yayan, but it's very expensive. It is very expensive. Today, transport is good in order to reduce traffic and commute goods. But let's tell ourselves the simple reality. As it is today, this one we were doing, how many years now? This one, this metro line from here to airport, how many years? Eleven. I mean, it's, so we must sit down and that's where it should be a national project. FCT is not for only residents of FCT. FCT is for the entire uh, Nigeria. So you can imagine now, if I want to do rail for two years or three years, I don't think we'll embark on any project again because of the cost. It's very astronomical. And when you look at the dollar component, <laughs> it's, it's, it's not you put here. So when we talk about railway, it's only federal government actually. In terms of funding or backing. Lagos funded it. Uh, how can you compare? <laughs> I mean, how can you compare? A state that makes over 50 billion mm -hmm. a month, you can take a load. A security against the IGA. Yes, mm -hmm. a security against the IGA. Mm -hmm. I'm struggling to get 20 billion. Mm -hmm. So I should go and uh, do red line that, that will cost over 200, uh, uh, 300 uh, million US dollars. Your Excellency, I think we have. Uh, We've done enough on... But it is necessary, very imperative. Mm -hmm. But if the federal government is okay, let's partner together. Okay. That's okay. What we want from uh, 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 FCT, 100 billion from you. All right. There are one who will pay. But not promise you know, <laughs> I will want the money to be <laughs> in the bank. <laughs> because, because when I see the way the budget... Without releases from the government. Ah, no, 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 no. Do you, do you, do you know what they gave to the FCT in 2023 budget? Eh? You know what they gave us? Yeah. 17 billion. National budget. 17. 17. 17. Now, how much was this? <laughs> how much was this? Yeah. One billion. <laughs> so, now. But you are doing well. Well. <laughs> Because we are determined, because okay, look at without if the president did not remove one from TSA, mm. how could we have been talking about projects? Mm. If the move from TSA has solved a lot of problems, what what is going to happen for 2024? Because we are going to tie our IGR to first coming from banks, so that we don't need to wait. Variation won't come. Even if you are paying them monthly, they can come for variation. But if, for example, now. The bank gives me 300 million, 400 as the case may be. And what do I do? I put all the money in the projects. No foundation will come. And in two years, you will have reduced the payment. And then you can say, okay, give me more funds. And you will see the astronomical growth in this city. Because one thing I, I assured Mr. President. That zeal, that my, that my zeal, commitment, passion for work I did in River State will not lower here. Rather, it will increase. And that's what is happening in FCT today. All okay. right. Let's, let's uh, talk more about that zeal. Mm -hmm. And look at, we'll flip the coin and look at the other side of it, which is politics. I hope you don't mind. What is mm. politics? Yeah. Let's mm. talk about reverse politics. politics. Mm. Yes. Well, uh, am I? Am I? You, let's talk about politics generally. You, you want to uh, time yes. it? Yes. As a matter of fact, honourable minister, was that politics? In fact, we, we, we are, is it true that the bone of contention or trouble broke loose when the governor of River State had made three appointments, which you said you did not approve of, and things went awry? Is it true? How could anybody have said that? Can I know those three appointments? They, 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 they didn't give us the names of the appointments. So, 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 so how will I know which are the appointments for yeah. me to say that? And You know, this is not correct. Let, yeah. let, let me tell you, I don't like Ingrid. I don't, I can't stand it. I 
I don't want to talk about this. When I see people talk, what is happening now is what if that fits very well in what Audley says in his book. Give a man power, money, is when you will know the person. If you have not given a man power, money, don't say you know the person. He may be a friend. He may be a son. He may be a sister. He may be a mother. He may be a father. If he does not have money and power, you won't know him. It's only when you have given him money and power that you know truly who this man or this woman is. I don't want to go into that. Nigerians know. I don't want to talk about it. All I'm saying, nobody's interested. Where are Look. As a man who meant well, I know what most states are suffering. In terms of debt, let them go on record whether that I kept debt. Liability, let them check. Before I left office, the records are there. Assets Bank, 7 billion. Zara Bank, 8 billion. How do you pay it? Collect 1, 1 billion from IGR every month. And that was paid off by October. This month. I was paying pension and gratuity every month. Which was not paid by my representatives. I took River State to the level that you can't discuss politics in Nigeria without talking about the River State. Has it dropped the ball in any way? You will assess. You can't talk about politics. Before I left, take for example, the health, the hospital that was commissioned three days ago. Yeah. The official Go and ask <coughs> contractors, when did they finish that hospital? The hospital was finished February. I was tired. Commissioning, I commissioned on the 27th of May. Even that was the day I flagged out Opopo Ring Road. I said, look, you have something for you to do 100 days. Take all these projects. This school, Universal for Dark Convocation, this one, this one. So use it to showcase, for to 100, showcase days. In 100 days. Politics came. No, oh, why are you, uh, why are you saying that is one? Uh, why would you be saying consolidation and continuity? Who said that? What is it? Look, I'm the FCT minister. What do I want? Politicians will tell you sign this. Politicians will tell you sign this. Let anybody show. What we are saying is that yeah. put the political family that brought you to be together. That's what you mean by no, don't touch my structure. Yes. Mm. This is something you, you didn't even contribute to it. People to the structure helped you. And you just start cancer. Within, three, yeah. within 100 days in office, you showed it clearly. And people are just talking about, oh, you say you should bring 25%. You say, you know, you just, I just look at this word. Is that this word is? Honorable Minister, do, do we want think, to. Do you want... think Governor uh, Fubara was acting like the same Fubara that you go all along you, that you have worked with? Look, or told, some look, politicians, let me tell you, let me tell you. some politicians were killed behind him and no, probably pulled him. These are politicians for a confrontation I have out of the state. Hmm. They yeah. have no chance. Yeah, perhaps look, they look, perhaps look, they realign uh, after I mean, they behind him. Let me tell you, to do what? Uh, behind him. Uh, to do what? Or no? To do what? To get at him. Just you. look. We are just starting. We are just starting politics. What you know, you know. What you don't know, you don't know. It is look. Everything is not about money. I was not a governor. I was an ordinary minister when I became a governor. I challenged the sitting governor and I defeated his candidate. Right? I was not carried by anybody like this.
and thrown there. I worked hard. I federal government fought me to the point that I couldn't have even done, I would have lost focus. You know what I passed through from 2015 to 2019? You know what I passed through in 2019 election? You know what I passed through? This one God gave you. No crisis for you. You are not the one important crisis. Do you know what it means that as a governor, I'm not resting at home? The federal government fought me very badly. But the structure remained. We all agreed we must do this. What's the problem? God gave you something on a platter of gold. No crisis. The federal government is not fighting you. Nobody's at home fighting you. You are the one trying to create crisis for yourself. What kind of system is that? What kind of system is that? Who does that? If, okay, no matter. Only ingrates. Only ingrates. In their board. That will support what is happening there. Only those who are natural ingrates. Forget about those you are seeing around. Those are people who couldn't come to the state because... Some of them, I, they say I refuse to make them governor. Isn't that the cause of the problem? That those people mm. now, because you are away from the state, they have seen an opportunity to, to is, own a safe Fubara governor. Is, I, have no I have no problem. You can own whomever you want to own. I have no problem. Look, look, in this politics, it's not the man who has the largest possible. In, in this policy, it's not the man who has the largest force. The time for politics will come. I'm concentrating on achieving... That's like second term. The yeah. mandate. Before second term. Yeah. Let me tell you. When I was gone. When I was gone. <laughs> Look. Uh, never one day. Never one day. Never. Nobody. This one is three, three months. Mm. Did this. Mm. You showed the world. You showed the world. Mm. Even if you can as you mean, do not consider. As you mean, no, do not consider. Anybody had wronged you to the point of uh, no return, as you mean, do not consider. Of what people did for you. In three months, you showed it. You showed your hand. Mm. So we want which to was your, your excellency. You. Which you was know. why because that I mean, question we keep reverberating, which is you know Sim very well. Mm. The Sim that you know, do you think he is acting on his own volition mm. or is no. acting some scripts no, 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 written no. for I have him? told you here. Because a lot of people will tell Listen, you. As I, as I said, I have you here. Even you now, I don't I, I claim I know you. But I give you power <laughs> money. Are you give me power money. Uh, <laughs> okay, <give> <laughs> <power. laughs> that, is, that is the only way you can know somebody. <laughs> no, you, but like I told you, I'm not worried. I'm a politician. Okay. Your excellency. I have what all it takes. Look, look. All of this could look. affect mm -hmm. your legacy as well. It, it, it doesn't work like this. Let me tell you. I don't worry myself when I see certain things in social media. The day I took decision, my team who took decision that was supposed to remove. The social media came down. They used this day, they used their eyes, every point that nothing was not said about me. Nothing in this world that was not said about me. I say, well, it's a decision, it's a political decision, I think will help our state. And today, our state is seeing, now, people are seeing the benefit of supporting as why I am a brother to I didn't take a wrong decision. Even that decision I took that time, ah, it was terrible. Yes, I saw what, so now uh, what you are saying is that article group that said I made them to fail is talking good about him. Those that didn't make that uh, I didn't give them governorship, that's okay. Mm. That is not the wrestling ground. Mm. So talking about I decisions. I use instrumentality of law to fight. Yes. I don't use uh, talks, yes. militants. I don't use the ethnicity to fight. No, yes. I don't do that. Right. It's instrumentality of law. Your Excellency, and sir. time will come. Right, Your Excellency, sir, talking about decisions, yes. you know, you talked about the decision of you know supporting the 
you know, president now. Talking about your decision of, you know, picking uh, Simfubara to succeed you, uh, do you have a cause to think, well, have I made the right decision? Are you regretting it? Difficult question. <laughs> <laughs> if you ask me truly, within what was available at that time, those who should themselves at that time, if I have given, if I support any of them, the next day I will be in trouble. They will have sweet camp tattoo. So you passed for three so months the, then. So your best option. Well, at that time, that's what you should have. Mm -hmm. So, but we never knew. It would be the three months to scatter a political structure that due to you to now begin to carry propaganda. Mm. Oh, this, oh, that. Now, let me tell you, you know, you know what is painful? You know what's painful when you see these allegations, lie, that I was angry. Who and who sat with me that when he was picked? I was the, I was the governor. Did he buy from? Somebody, what I want to tell you, be grateful in life. In all circumstances, not that I'm not. Mm, I don't no, know. Not <laughs> Be grateful in your life in all circumstances. Sir, you. We, I, we, I, I, I know that people bring politics when you are showing. In great. Ah, no, no, no. no, no. Your Excellency. You see, any politician I see, yeah. or any so called elder, mm. and I see around such person, I see you as an English. Mm. No, nobody just who is mm. a gentleman. Who is a politician that knows what politics are about? We support that kind of thing. But we can't quiet. I told everybody, keep quiet. No? Okay, let me tell you. How? You have 31 members in the assembly. 31. 27 against you. 27 against you. But some people will say what goes around comes around. Mm. That this is exactly what, what he did to Roti Biyami. I was not with Amit. Amit didn't bring me to the governor. We do respect. We do respect. He made I you his chief of staff. He made you minister. No, 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 no. It's not true. I was the one that led the work family to the governor. We do respect. In 2007, yes. Are you not aware? Are you not aware? Right. Yes. Even making me a minister, he went back to another service to disqualify me to SSS. Yes. Yeah, you know that way. Did he support, did he bring me to be governor? Mm -hmm. He fought me. Even as a minister. He made you his chief of staff. Oh my God, what do you mean by that? Who and then I put you as a minister, oh, representing okay. no, the last No, 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 you don't. I don't because the time, you don't have the time, so yeah, I don't want to tell. Yeah. But yeah. the point I'm making is that, look, I'm comfortable. My brother did not give me minister. He gave me minister of uh, FCT. What is what, what? What am I looking for? But that does not mean I will allow him to crumble our political structure. It will not happen because you can. Nobody talk about your governance. Go ahead. Let me tell you. I challenge anybody. All the roads, all projects you are seeing there, I lead the family. I say, listen, for your second tenor. Look, look, the ring road, I, I passed it as governor in a, a Zerubi council meeting. I said, you must do this wrong as you are coming. I took him to Wins Biden in Germany with the Commission of Works, Director of uh, Procurement, to go and negotiate with Jonas Becker. I, I said, look, if you do this ring road, your second tenor, you, you, you are yeah, short. If I meant bad, I told him go and borrow money from Joros Bank. I mean from uh, Zene Bank. Pay Joros Bank. Let them be deducting from you if you want. Joros Bank said you will do it in three years, which means that is a year leading to your election. Mm -hmm. Nobody will challenge you in state. Did if you? I have no good intention. I will not do it. I remember asking you this I question too. Mm -hmm. But did, did you sanction this impeachment? Who's in picture? If you cannot, when you are sorry, you see, you have to be careful. Why would I? Look, if they are impeaching you, did you call me? Assuming I'm the one who plotted it, for example, did you call me? Ah, 
Sir, they, they want to impeach me. Is that why you send people to go and burn the hollow chamber? Is impeachment done one day? Impeachment process, is it a one day? Then you raise ethnic politics. We have never had it like this before. For an ethnic group to come and say this. We've seen you together after that time. We thought you've made up. Uh, uh, will anybody stop you from going to function? So that was a photo ops. I'm not in present. What <coughs> he has apologized. Listen, listen. No, not to Mr. President. You see, <coughs> anything that will make me not to respect Mr. President can never. It's not. It's not, it's not there. All you see, you are saying him dancing around. It's because Mr. President said, Minister, don't believe it. Do, do this. You go and do this. He disobeyed President. That president, it's a very bad president. It, look, politics is not. Uh, when the law speaks, Togri will run away. When the law speaks, militants will run away. When the law speaks, ethnicity will run. The law has not spoken. Have you foreclosed mm. any, any amicable mm. resolution of this? Do they, do they tell I had any problem? All I'm saying, mm. this is a structure that brought you. Be fair to them. Okay. Be fair to the structure that brought you. Don't, you see, even those who we are opposed to you, you are, you are, you are insulting those, you, are, you know, look, nobody says, here you go But all you must understand is that people had sleepless nights. Because mm. people took it. You don't just throw them away like that. It is too early. I've never seen this happen anywhere. First of all, you have portrayed yourself, you have told Nigerians who I am. Some people even pretend that about one year, two years, they don't understand me. I show their true color. Three months. No, not, not, that's not what you can say in this world, though. Let me tell you, that's not what you can say. Nobody is supporting you there. It's just they are supporting you because they think that they are fighting with you. Mm. It's not that they are Your, excellen your Excellency, it's talking about. It's as if that, that, that yeah. what you're doing is a lie. Yeah, yeah. Your Excellency. All sir. those who cannot fight me are now coming around you. I will still win them. Your Excellency. At the appropriate time, I will win. Your Excellency. Mark it today. Mark it today. Proper time, being <laughs> one is good for second time. I don't know. Mark it today. <laughs> you, you, you will see. You will see. You will see. Well, well, what, see, that is language I normally tell them. If it didn't day, it didn't day. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you don't know what it means. Leave it. Uh, you, I have respected Mr. President, Mr. Vice President. I will not do anything. I have not kept quiet. Well, what all of this needs to is that if this crisis is to end, it has to be the decision of the two of them. You know, as the elder person. I don't know. And to forgive him. You I, as the elder person. Don't you think I it have, is a comment on you because you are the one who brought him come. and introduced him to. Uh, the yeah, people of Rivers yeah, as yeah. your successor. Hold on. Doesn't that put hold the hold responsibility on, on you to reach hold out to me as the elder brother? Look at the people. Tell, for example, the, the one that's spreading the news. Oh, I brought the sheriff. I removed the sheriff. I brought the news. I removed the news. Who's interested in that kind of rubbish? Who, who's interested in that? I brought the sheriff. He went to undo us. As a petition, I will not say. He brought the news. Plot on do us as you fulfilled my hand. I mean, no sense, no sense, no amount of uh, ethnic mm, sentiment will change us. We will come, you will see, you, you will see who politics in the state. It's small, small, take it easy. No amount of like nail, no amount of this. I'm not worried. Have, have you ever seen me issue statement one day? Have you ever seen me issue statement one day? All those propaganda. Abuse me. That was the same time. That was how I was abused. By the time when we were bringing in, they said it's not very proper. Your Excellency. Now they have not said, oh, as I want to No problem. Who, who All right. Which, All right. Time will come. Your Excellency, if you look at your phone and Governor Fubara is calling, will you pick? Ah, if Governor calls you, you don't pick. <laughs> you ask I'm a loyal uh, river citizen. I'm a very loyal citizen. But you don't know me very well. If you know me very well, you know what I Look, one thing you can look, people may hate me. You don't remember, it's not my business. But what I can never stand is English. Take, for example, 
And so you made me Minister of FCT. I've had so many things people talk at the back. In fact, I was uh, talking with you was on the other day. He was telling me that people say, oh, they're empowering me. Who knows 2027? I said, was it where you came for, for his cooking lessons? That, uh, and, uh, you, don't, you don't need to ask me where it was. <laughs> As a chief, you know, people don't have character. I have character. What will happen to yourself? I stood. And I said, I'm not going to support this injustice. I was not to do this, they will do me that. The time you need to generalize. Some people are alleging that no, you are no, still no. in PDP to wreck that party. Oh, what did that say? That you have one leg it in PDP and one to, leg in PDP. You must alive before they wreck you now. And, and, There's somebody that is dead that you and, and, Hold on, and and yes, they, No, no, they don't cut me short. Hold on, don't cut me short. Sure, I okay. I, I will not. I will not. Um, <laughs> so, I stood firm with my friends. Injustice. We will not allow it. We will not allow it. I will never collect it. And the president is there. Some people would have gone to the president and said, sir, to keep this G5, we need social amount of money. We never collected one naira. I challenge anybody. When we took a decision that we support Mr. President, we went to him, said, sir, we will support you. We have looked at the two people from the side. You are the winnable candidate. Not on sentiment. Not on religious background. My friend is a reverend. Yes. I don't know. I want to wear my vote. I want to wear the first state to be relevant and somebody who will lead Nigeria very well. So, now, I never knew, okay, even if I knew, okay, maybe we'd be minister, assuming. I never knew you would give me FCT minister, right? Now you get it. Now somebody is not, you know, politicians are terrible. This city, you are seeing sitting here, I'm sitting here. Look, there are some people who are not happy from ethnic background. There are some people with little background that are not happy. There are some people on party line that are not happy. So they hit you here, they hit you here, they hit you here, they carry all kinds of information. And they say, oh, okay, we'll run against you. Hey, we don't have character at all. So you look at me. After being a city minister, I'm going to collect form. Under which party? It will be, it will be APC, that I collect the form from APC. And uh, look at the uh, Tribu, I want to run against you. I mean, people just, people don't have character. Or I go to PDP. They give me form. I want to run against, I mean, these are political talent, uh, harlots, who have no character. I have character. I would have, I would have changed. In the Southeast and South South presidential election, where the tribal win? Only rivers. I challenge anybody. Did they bring money for us for him to win there? And people, instead of you to focus on achievement, focus on people who are committed to supporting the man to achieve. You are focusing on ir irrelevant propaganda. When they hear, we get fear, 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 fear. So, so that, you know, I said it to stop you from asking any non question. I say non question. They say you will run. So somebody will bring me to I'll be I'll be the VP. To who? I'm standing that the South should be president. Then you want to bring me to be VP. But so why did I stand to, uh, for the South to be president? Or oh, you make me to present candidate. And then you think that the North will support me. They will say no, let the people finish his uh, second term. But if it's me now go and run uh, it is. I, you must know the political realities. So nobody should sell those kind of dummy to people. It's useless dummy and for people who don't have brain. At my level in politics today, you come and sell such dummy to me. You are light. Come and save us. Save you to where? Honorable Minister, ah. our, our time is fast. Mm -hmm. We just have to probably call it a day here, but just give us your party shots in, say, 60 seconds. Well, for me, uh, I thank you, and all I need to emphasize is that all of us are Nigerians. We should change uh, this, uh, we should change the narrative. 
and support the president so that we will achieve. You know, one thing I've always told people, even the opposition will say, well, if, if the man does well, do we have opportunity? You understand me? To contest election? No. Yeah, I hear you. You are he should do well. So Nigerians will not continue to suffer. Don't be selfish. Because at the end of it, the president does not do well. Who is losing? Nigeria. Nigeria. Then we start all over again. I mean, support him. That election will come. You have issues to say, look, this is why this should not be, this is why this should not be. But not to say, uh, no, let, you, uh, let the government fail so that uh, I will have opportunity to, to come. I've never seen that kind of selfish uh, interest. Now they should continue to go down simply because you want to run president in 2027. So now they shouldn't, the economy should not improve. The masses should continue to suffer. So you use it as a, as, 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 as a foul to be voted for. I've never seen such a kind of politics. So right. now they should support us. The residents of Nigeria should know that we mean well for them. Mm. Nobody will come here to make anybody to suffer. Nobody will come here to do that. Mm. And I, 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 of, uh, I work very hard for River State. I think, look, what I did in River State, even our assets, I fought up to Supreme Court. Up to our assets. It's us me being APC or PDP. Whatever. You say Nigerians should support us. Is that APC or PDP? Nigerians should support the administration of oh. Bola Tribu mm. right. so we can, we can <laughs> reroll, we leave this economic action. Why are you oh. doing people always emphasize PDP? No, 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 we need to be clear. Right, we don't know Can you just resist? Can you just no, 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 okay, okay. La, la, la. We have to go now. Okay, let me go. Uh, I belong for Tinubu to succeed. Okay, sir. All right. Anything let's, that will make Tinubu to succeed, that's where I am. Let's leave it there, sir. Thank you so much. And that's why I voted for him. And we voted for him. So we cannot change that now. Thank you, sir. Thank you very much. All right. Uh, Chevalier, <laughs> it's been a long day. Yes, indeed. It's been a pleasure. <laughs> To uh, have His Excellency. Uh, mm. Yes, he's spoken about quite a number of issues. So we mm. do hope that uh, moving forward, we'll be back to take a look at some of those projects and see if uh, it is what His Excellency has said it will be. And sure, the same thing for all the other ministers, we reckon. So because they signed an MOU with mm. the people. So we have to thank everybody. Thank uh, you. Thank, thank you for watching. Thank you, Chairman. Yeah, so, yeah. Okay. Your yeah. Excellency is always a delight speaking to yeah. you. No, don't from, provoke him. From Just... concept to actuality, you have put a bridge. Yeah. Yeah. The project, we continue to put an eye on those projects. Thank, Thank you. you. And of course, I Vintage, we you so wicked. I've not met you before. This is the first time I will be meeting oh, you. Oh, really? But <laughs> I enjoyed myself thoroughly. Wow. Thank you very much. <laughs> Welcome to the forum. Thank you. Thank you so much. <laughs>